Hi pals, it's Rich and I'm back today with sharks versus dinosaurs in the spinning wheel slime game. To play, put in the comments which of these characters you think has the slime in it and you can be a winner. Is it the Triceratops? Is it the Velociraptor? Is it the Hammerhead Shark? Is it the T-Rex? Is it the Pufferfish? Is it Indominus Rex? The Whale Shark? My favorite Pachycephalosaurus? A Great White Shark? Or the Cool Anglerfish? Put your answer in the comments and see if you're a winner. And we've got a ton of fan art, man. We're gonna open today. Let's spin it. All right, cool, we got T-Rex. All right, T-Rex, let's punch your box and see if you're in there. One, two, three. Oh, oh, no slime. What do we get? Oh, this is crazy. This is a giant microbe heart. Wait, what's that noise? I hear something's coming. Whoa. This thing is cool. This is the heart, and it says it's actual size, and this is probably the actual size of a heart. They say if you make a fist, that's about the size of an adult heart. Cool, we finally got everything out. Take a look. It's got a whole bunch of pieces, so you could build a whole bunch of different configurations of this, but we're not going to build them all for you. We'll just show you a couple uh, of different ways you can build. All right, so he's put together in the basic mode, the first way to put them together. You can see that there's a little seat up here. Somebody can sit and control them. There's a button back here that you could push. And he makes different noises. And his eyes light up, do stuff. So yeah, he's like a mechanical robot. I mean, obviously. So pretty cool. Let's see if we can put together another mode real quick. So what's cool is you can pop these off down here. Put this on it. And same thing for his arms up top. You can basically put this in his hands just like this. And then you've got motorized bot take a look mm. so you just push down and he goes Shh. looks like he's doing a split remember you pick which of these you think has slime in it and then also put at the end who you think wins the sharks or the dinosaurs with the coolest toys all right let's move on let's spin it oh nice we get the hammerhead shark let's see does the hammerhead have the slime Let's see if he does. Ready? One, two, three. Nope, put some in here. What is it? Oh, what? What is this? Oh, he's called the common cold. There's another giant microbe. And actually, that's what I have today. I've got the common cold. So really neat. This is kind of cool, too. Gives you facts about the common cold. Really neat. Let's throw them up there. But wait, I hear something big coming. Boom. Time for me to go shark hunt. Well, good luck with that, because uh, sharks kind of crazy around here. Yeah, well, somebody's got to do it. Adios, Mary. See you later, Bill. Wow, the water's really shallow. Not too shallow for me. So pretty cool set. Take a look at all the stuff you get with this set. It is really a lot. That's one thing I always say about the Animal Planet is that their sets just are full of accessories. You get a lot of bang for your buck. That's an awesome shark. It's a really cool hammerhead. Gotta love the mouth action, the jaw action. You can always use a shark cage. Really cool. Comes on this cool crane. What's cool is you can just drop it with one push. Bang. Uh, obviously it's got two figures. It's got a woman and it's got a man. It's also got a cool shark. Grab the shark in this thing. You can tie that to, you can attach that to the crane as well, or you can swap with this. It's got a whole bunch of accessories. Look at all this stuff. Fins and stuff for the characters. It's got a bunch more fish. It's got an angler fish. It's got a little octopus, a turtle, like a moray eel. Got another net, scooping net. And then you got the boat. The boat is pretty cool. The boat's got a lot of cool features to it. It's got a cool net on the back with this. Again, it's got the cool crane. It's got some radar. Oh, it's even got a gun. Bang! Nice, you got a little Kodiak boat that you can go to shore with real easy. Really neat. I mean, I think we paid on sale, if you go now, Toys R Us, probably about 30 bucks for this. 
And for 30 bucks, you get a lot of stuff. You get the, the big boat, the characters, lots of accessories. It's not always quality, sometimes it's quantity. And with this in the Animal Planet, that's what you get. So sweet, I think we're off to a good start. And oh, this thing's a little cooler than you there, Rusty you Rivet. Maybe, maybe not. So cool, let's move on. Let's spin it. All right, cool, we got the angler fish. Come on, angler fish. Are you the one that's got the slime? I don't know, let's find out. Ready? One, two, three. Wait, whoa, what do we got? We got some batteries, what? What do we got batteries for? Take a look at this, this is an angler fish drone. What, you can fly the sky and it glows at night? You gotta be kidding me, this thing is awesome. Here it is. What, this thing is wicked. Pretty, wow, let's put this down here. It comes with a pretty neat controller and it comes with some extra stuff and some instructions. All right, cool, so we're ready to get it going. So underneath is the battery pack that we charged. Right over here is the on-off switch. So let's turn it on. See the eyes are blinking. And then here is the remote control. It takes uh, three, I think it's triple A's. And then you've got buttons all over the place. All right, so we turned it on and here it goes. Look, the light, the light here, oh, get up. Oh, there it goes. Oh, oh, steering it this way. Look at it, it stays stable. So what's really cool is it's, you can go down, you can go up, you can go backwards, you can go forward. Whoa, it turns, look at that. Come over this way, go to land, land, boom. Some whack driving. Oh! Oh! Two thumbs up. We love it. Oh, that drone was sweet. Let's charge it up again. Let's spin it. Oh, we got Indominus Rex. Indominus has slimed us quite a few times in this game. So will he slime us this time? Let's move this out of the way so I don't hurt myself. All right, Indominus, ready? Here we go, one, two, three. No, no slime, but we got some stuff. What do we got? Oh, cool. That's it, we got those things. So we've got a slimy dino egg, cool. And then we've got, what is this? Oh, man, look at that. It's a McDonald's Happy Meal. It's Dino Motion Dinosaurs. And this guy is Charlene Sinclair. Collect all three. What? That's just crazy. All right, let's, let's open this thing first. Let's see what this is. This is a classic Happy Meal toy that I got on eBay. Take a look at this. Uh, 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 uh. There was obviously this show called Dinosaurs or this movie. I don't remember it, but pretty wild. This is like from, this is from 1992. And there's a whole series of these guys and they all do different crazy stuff. So this obviously is like, this is some kind of female dinosaur. It looks like she's a triceratops. You can see the top of her. And she's on a phone. That's kind of crazy. And then you use this little thing here. It shoots air through this tube to cause some type of motion. So if you really wanted to make a crazy like skit, you could be like, yo, what's up, man? I'm on the phone. Who is it? What? What are you talking about? Open that egg and stop wasting time. All right. So let's take a look at this egg. Let's see what's in this egg. This looks pretty cool. I love eggs. I love them. What's in here? Oh, here it comes. Oh, slime. We got slime. Oh, oh that's some nasty red slime. It's kind of more like putty than slime. Maybe it is slime. Oh, look, there's something inside. And it stinks. Oh, whew. It looks like, uh, almost like an ankylosaurus, but Let's do a super bonus question, pals. Put in the comments, who is this dinosaur? Or what is this dinosaur? Tell us a little bit about it. All right, cool. I think that's it, that's it, right? Nothing else in there? Nothing else. All right, let's go to the next one. Let's spin it. Oh, we got the great white shark. Oh, great white shark has been known to slime us before. 
Let's see if you got us this time, Sharky. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, we got, what did we get? Oh, we got big jaws, fizzy egg, and wait, something's coming. Oh, what is that? We got the shark pier playset. All right, let's get some water so we can get our fizzy go. All right, let's get this open and drop it in water. Woo! Ah, all these fizzies got these on them. All right, here we go. Ready? Set. She's a fizzy. All right, let's move this over to the side. Oh, she's really fizzing now. Look at her go. Fizz central. All right, so it's got a pretty cool little car here. Got a couple figures. It looks like a a dude talking and a pelican. That's pretty crazy. And then this scene comes out of here. It's a lighthouse over here. And then it's got like a little house here. A little ramp goes down here. And basically what you try to do is get this guy through. Woo! He just goes through and just comes down inside. But then what happens is if you get crazy with it, you could be like, what's up? And the shark gets him. So pretty cool. So he drives through, boop, boop, boop. And then what happens? Shark, shark. No, don't get the shark. So pretty cool little shark. This is a neat little playset. Just a little something to goof around with. You can see from behind that how you move the shark is by the fin right here. Bust it through. Matchbox always had some cool, cool shark stuff. I always liked their stuff over the years. But you can see that you can attach them to different uh, different play sets and have, you know, like a crazy set going and whatnot. All right, cool. Looks like our fizzy's done. Let's see what we got in there. Is he done? So here he is. He's a little shark that came out of there. He's almost like a bottom feeder type shark. I don't know. What is he? Uh, no, he's not a nurse shark. If you think you know what he is, vote right now on the top of the page where the eye is and see if you are correct. Or we'll see how smart all the other viewers are too. Take a look at the poll right now and pick one of the choices. All right, that was pretty cool by the sharks. All right, I'll give it to you. All right, let's get to the next one. Let's spin it. All right, we got the raptor, sweet. All right, raptor, you've been known to slime me a few times too. So let's see if it's the raptor. Ready, one, two, three. Oh, what's in here? Oh, what is that? That's crazy, look at it. Jellyfish or something, let's see what it says. Oh no, it's E. coli. You definitely don't want E. coli. There's another giant microbe, really cool. It says it's a million times the actual size. Look how cute he looks though, E. coli. Wait, and I hear something else coming. What the, whoa, look at that. That looks like a T-Rex skull. It is, it's a T-Rex skull, cool. It's a kid's T-Rex. Oh, it's a sand toy. Nice. He's sticking in the sand like that. Or put him on your hands like this. Hey, pals, it's Rich, and I'm here to eat some E. coli today. I think this is a pretty cool toy. It's like a sand toy, they say. So you could dig in it, you could bury it in the sand and pretend you just found some dinosaur bones. It is pretty neat. And you can see it just, your hand goes right in here. Your thumb goes right in there, and nice, like it. I could definitely use this in some skits in the future. All right, well that's cool, it wasn't the raptor. Let's move on to the next one. Let's spin it. Oh cool, we got the Triceratops. All right, Triceratops, don't you slime us. Don't you slime us, ready, one, two, Oh, we got some stuff. Oh, we got another egg. Oh, look, we got a couple more. That's it, that's all we got in there. We got a couple more of those uh, McDonald Happy Meal toys. Crazy, this one is called Frank Sinclair. Crazy, all right, let's open this up first. Let's see what we got. All right, look, that guy's got a stand. Oh, it looks like a girl. She's wearing pink. Put it on there, okay. And let's see what motion. Frank Sinclair does. A little dancing. I have a feeling these dinosaurs from this show or this movie, they did a lot of singing and dancing, which is kind of cool. All right, let's open up this next one. Oh, here he is, and he is Robbie Sinclair. Sounds like his brother. And what does he got? He's got a guitar. Oh, 
All right, let's get both of these going at the same time. Dee -dee 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 -dee. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh man, I don't know what they were thinking. McDonald's, what are you doing? This is the worst Happy Meal toy ever. All right, cool. Let's open up this egg here. Maybe we can salvage it. Well, we know what's in here. I hope it's a different color than red. Dang. All right, come on. That's some sticky slime. Pretty nasty. Oh, who is this? Cool, nice green stegosaurus. At least he contrasts really well with the red slime. Not bad. Let's just stick him right back in. <laughs> All right, let's move on to the next one. Let's spin it. All right, cool, we got my best friend, the Pachycephalosaurus. What's up, Pachy? You gonna slime me, Pachy? I know you can't do that to me. You're my boy, you're my boy. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, look what we got, we got more. We got another slime, and we got another one of these. Another one of the dinosaurs. This one's called Grandma Ethel. Oh, come on. Look what you've done to me, McDonald's. Look at Grandma Ethel. This is, what is she gonna do? No, she don't do nothing in the front. Look, her tail on the back wags. That's crazy. Come on, man. But wait, I hear something. Oh, look out, Grandma Ethel. Stegosaurus. Nice. At least we got something decent. All right, so this is pretty cool. Take a look at the Stegosaurus. And then you got this handler guy right here, who's also pretty kind of kind of cool, kind of cool. What he's got is he's got the grabber, which is nice. So this dude's gonna grab Grandma Ethel instead of the Stegosaurus. What's he gonna do with her? She gonna wag her tail, man. She gonna wag her tail at you, dude. Pretty bad. All right, enough of that. Bah. Even though Stegosaurus, I don't think would do that or be that aggressive. All right, we got one more of these eggs to open. It's gonna be red slime, I bet. There it is, red slime. Wait, don't go on Grandma Ethel. Don't go on her. Oh, Grandma Ethel got slime, man. Poor thing. What you doing, dude? Oh, what's in here? Let's see what we got. Oh, we got another Stego. Hey, look, it's a Stego for your Stego. Go for a ride. Well, get out of here, man. All right, getting sick of these eggs and the slime, but whatever. It's still kind of cool. Grandma Ethel, that's pretty funny to play with. I'm sure that Toy Boy Cooper could do something with that. So it's down to two. It's down to the whale shark and the puffer fish. So if you haven't put an answer in the comments, you can still play. You got a 50-50 chance to win. Which is it going to be? The puffer fish or the whale shark? Let's find out. Let's spin it. All right, we got the whale shark. All right, whale shark, are you it? Let's see if you're it. Ready, one, two, three. Oh, no, what do we get? Oh, we got something different. So definitely we know who's got the slime. And this guy is, what, he's a brain cell. Another giant microbe. Cool, and this is one million times the size. Some of us have brain cells. Some of us have big brain cells, but pretty neat. And then what do we get? Look at him. Wow, great detail. Nice and soft, nice leopard seal. Hey, leopard seal. <laughs> so a nice leopard seal. All right, let's get to the end. We know who we're gonna get next. Let's spin it. Yup, we got the puffer fish. And here it is, unless I didn't put slime. In one of them, or in any of them, I think the slime's in the puffer fish. So let's see what we got. One, two, three. Oh yeah, we got the slime, and it's red slime too, just like those nasty eggs. Oh, look at it coming, here it is. Oh, nice. So if you put the puffer fish has the slime as your answer, then put I'm a winner in the comments. And if you didn't, no big deal. You're still a winner, we're all winners here. Nice, this is nasty, this red slime, I'm really not feeling it. it. Why is it a red slime day? We got red slime in these, red in these, pretty nasty. Wait, what do we get? Oh, it's another prize by Safari, and it is Bernie, Bernie the alligator. Nice, look at Bernie. 
He is a real nice detailed alligator. Really cool. Really, really neat. So here's the aftermath of the video. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So also put in the comments who you think won this battle. Was it the sharks or was it the dinosaurs? I think the sharks may be won and out. Even though some of these dinosaur toys were all right. This Animal Planet set was really cool. Um, but it was real tight. It was real tight. So put it in there. And we've got a ton of fan art, man. We're going to open today. All right, let's get going with this small one from St. Paul, Minnesota. This is all new fan art mail. It's not the real old stuff. Whoa, look at that. It looks like Godzilla sneaking around the mountain. Cool. My name is Henrik. I'm eight years, uh, six years old. There's a movie called Eight vs. Monster. The monster is not Godzilla. What? Cool. It must be like a lizard type. Very cool. It looks like that's a whale jumping out. Look at that little. Uh, looks like a little raptor and a Godzilla. Cool, Hendrik. You get the double thumbs up. Sweet. All right, and then we get this postcard from Indonesia. Wow, and it's from Wurya from Indonesia. You get the double thumbs up, Wurya. Very nice. Thank you. Oh, this is from Henrik again. Henrik, look at that. That is cool. All right. This is some kind of crazy king. That's me. That's a door. That looks like some kind of octopus apple dude. Henrik. Oh, wow. Now, look at this. Richard, videos are the best. Have you watched? What does it say, Mona? There are monsters that are in the coconut pirates, tomatoes, and the Kika the fire monster. What? This is really cool. Mona's on Disney, huh? Moana's, Moana's on Disney. I have to take a look at that. Sorry, Mona's. Um, really cool, Henrik. You get the double thumbs up. Great job, pal. All right, here we get the next one. Whoa. Here, bitch, I love your videos. This is from Garrett Donker, age 11. Nice, legendary Godzilla, Garrett. Very cool. And then this one is from Luke. He's five years old. It's from Garrett and Luke. We love your videos. We are brothers, and we are in Indiana. Look at burning Godzilla. That's cool. Luke, great job. Garrett, great job. You both get the double thumbs up. Luke and Garrett, sweet. Whoa, look at this one. Now that's cool, man. This is from James. This looks like a King Ghidorah and a Godzilla and a tank. It's a buildings on fire. James, really cool. Whoa, what is that? That's a cool snake eating a snake. Eating itself. I don't know what that is, but that's sweet. All right, great job, James. Look, at the parachute's coming down, too. You get the double thumbs up. Great job. Look, this is from Luca. All right, Luca, whoa, look at EH5. Look at the King Ghidorah versus the Godzilla. That's a great job. He's from Duluth, Minnesota. Whoa, that is a cool town. I've been there. I used to live in Minnesota. Excellent job, Luca. You get the double thumbs up. I love how it pops out. Look at that. You can see from back here. Everybody knows what it is. Great job, Luca. And this is from Clara. Oh, okay. People are writing their names on the back. I think that's a good way to do it. Whoa, it's a big one. This is from Clara. Whoa, cool. It's a Godzilla fighting. I think it's a King Kong. Clara, age five. Sweet job. You get the double thumbs up, Clara. Great job. Oh, hello. This is a drawing of Godzilla versus Ghidorah. I am eight years old. Daniel A. Sweet. This is cool. Very good detail. I love how you use the pencil. Look, there's a little castle over here. Here's Ghidorah. Got Godzilla wrapped up, just like the movie. That's a great job, Daniel. You get the double thumbs up. All right, and then you got a couple other ones. Let's see what you got here. Was Godzilla 2014. Very good. That's a great job. Looks like Muto sneaking up on him over here. Yep, favorite thing to draw is Godzilla. Love it, Daniel. And you got one more. Whoa, 
and there you go. This is King of the Monsters, Godzilla. And here he comes, Kong, with his battle axe. He's going to smash him. And somebody's saying, ah, great job, Daniel. You get the double thumbs up. All right, here's a crazy colored one. It's from Tobin. This is not a regular Godzilla. Turn it around. It says, whoa. Nice! Is a flaming rainbow Godzilla has all the blasts in the world. Whoa, that is crazy, man. I love the colors. Look at it. Really great job, Tobin. That's very creative. You get the double thumbs up. So far, I think you're in the hunt for the best one. Scary version of me, Roman. What? Alright, let's see what that means. Whoa. This is Monster X, Concrete Man, Loch Ness Monster, Swamp Man, Bloop, Shark Squid. Whoa, Roman, that is really cool. Roman, I am age five. Sweet. Roman, that is awesome. Double thumbs up. Whoa, what do we have here? This is from Isaiah. Look at that Godzilla. He's ready to destroy something. He's not happy. Look, something's on fire. It's a building on fire. Isaiah, great job. You get the double thumbs up. Whoa. Look at this. King Ghidorah by Aurora. Woo, that's cool. I love it, Aurora. That's a great name. And then you have on this side. Whoa, it was good. Aurora Princess, I love your videos. Love Aurora. I watch Godzilla vs. King Kong. Sweet Aurora. These are great drawings. Whoa, look at the T-Rex on the back there. That's cool, man. I like it. Aurora, you get the double thumbs up, Princess Aurora. Sweet. We are super fans. What? Now that will get your attention. Let's see what we got here. Super fans, super fans. Whoa. This is from Monsieur. Whoa, look at this one. This is from Bane, age five. Whoa, look at this. This is like an underwater scene. It goes that way. It looks like, look at it. Godzilla under, underwater and little Godzillas, I think. And then, what is this guy? Whoa, this is cool though. It's an underwater scene. And then the other side, whoa, these are dinosaurs. Love it. Look at Pterodactyl. And Mosasaurus. Excellent job, Bane. That is awesome. Awesome. You get the double thumbs up. But let's look at these other ones real quick. This is from Ike, age five. Look at that. That's great for age five. You got a Ghidorah, Rodan, Godzilla. Excellent, Ike. You get the double thumbs up. And then there's one more that you guys sent. Oh, age three. This is from Hadley, age three. Oh, look how cute this is. I love it. Look at this happy guy. <laughs> and nice faces. Hadley, that is adorable. So Hadley, Ike, and Bane, you all get the double thumbs up. No, we get a triple thumbs up since there's three of you. Sweet. Thanks for being super fans. Awesome job. All right, what do we got here? Oh, this is a good one. My name is James. Look at the Rodan. And I love your videos, Godzilla. Keep posting, King Ghidorah. <sighs> Hi, Rich. I am nine years old. Godzilla. Look at that. Who's that down there? I don't know. But that is pretty cool, James. I love the detail of it, how it goes subterranean underwater. And, and then it has like a little landscape here. And then you got Rodan. And then you got Zod. This is a great job. Excellent, James. Double thumbs up. All right, what do we have here? Whoa, this is Hydra against Colossal. Nice. This is really cool. I love it. It's like water uh, paint. And then we've got a nice little thing. My name is Lucy, and I love watching your videos. You have a collection, too. Whoa, I hope you like my drawing. Keep making all those awesome videos. I'm going to try my best. Lucian, you love the Kaiju games in Roblox. I hear you. I've played some of those and put them on Yummy Gummy, our other channel. But it's kind of hard to keep doing them. But anyway, excellent job, Lucian. You get the double thumbs up. Keep up the great work. Let's see. There's a few in here. This is the last one. Rich. Whoa, that's cool. All right. 
Whoa, that's me too, Rich. All right, let's see what this says. You guys sent me a lot of stuff a bit too much. Just saying, you can't send everything you've ever driven. All right, Godzilla vs. King Kong, awesome. Says, Rich, your videos are awesome. And it says, dinosaurs, do you think the dinosaurs will come back to Earth again? Ooh, what a great question. I don't think so, but you never know. You know what, in the future, I bet you we do have something like a Jurassic Park that happens. Because you know how crazy the scientists are. Look at that one. Alright, cool. And now we have to... Okay, very good job. I don't know what your name is, but you are from Tucson, Arizona. And you get the double thumbs up. Thanks for sending all the stuff. If you want to be featured on one of our videos upcoming, please look at the About Us section. Look about us. It'll say the instructions on where to send it. It changes because we've moved around and we've changed P.O. boxes and stuff like that. But thank you for sending your fan art mail. I appreciate it. You need to help me out by liking this video, sharing it with a friend, watching our videos. Go through all our videos and watch them. YouTube is changing and it's making it very hard for me to make videos and I need your help, pals. So help our brother out and watch the videos. Click that like button and subscribe for more cool videos from Toy Pals TV. And remember, pals, what? Don't be a bully, cause nobody likes a bully. Take care pals, we'll see you soon.